Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how a computer mouse works. I'm first going to explain to you how a ball mouse works, and then I'm going to show you a little bit of how an optical mouse works. Let's go to our computer. And I'm going to pull up this diagram here. This is a uh, basic a ball mouse, uh, kind of viewed uh, from a cross section. This little green uh, circle here is the ball that's in the bottom of your mouse. Now, as you move the mouse across the surface, um, basically either um, in the X plane or in the Y plane, right here, or right, this will be the X plane and that will be the Y plane, uh, the ball that's inside the mouse rotates. Now, attached to that little ball, right here, kind of rubbing up against it, is a tiny little roller that rolls along with um, the ball. So as this ball rolls, kind of like a gear, it'll also turn this roller, which will turn this larger roller that has a tiny device that detects, as, that, detects that roller as it's uh, rolling. So since this ball is rolling, this smaller gear is rolling and turning this larger gear, this electronic device will notice that that large gear is turning and will register that uh, and send that as a movement um, through this mouse cable up to your computer. Now this other um, this other wheel over here basically does the other axis uh, as the wheel turns. Uh, basically, if you're moving your mouse up or down, one of these rollers will get that movement. If you're moving your mouse left to right, the other roller uh, will pick up that movement and transmit those changes. Now I have here an optical mouse that I'm going to show you as well, which uh, acts a little bit differently. As you can see in the optical mouse, you can tell one's optical when you look at the bottom. It'll have a red uh, kind of laser light coming out of it. You can sort of see that reflection there in my hand a little bit. Um, basically, the difference between a an optical mouse and a ball mouse is that this uses a very low power laser which beams out across the surface that the mouse is sitting on. Now, lasers are reflective. So as it's beaming out and hitting the, the surface uh, that it's sitting on, that laser will then reflect back to um, a sensor inside of the mouse. And that sensor will detect the changes in the layout of the surface that it's laying on. You know, basically uh, textures in the wood of your desk, for instance. It'll notice that those textures are changing, which means it's detecting that the mouse has been moved. My name is Dave Andrews, and I've just explained to you how a mouse works.